out our window. In this episode of Marina Queen, I try to have lunch with my wife without having my rental car broken into. Still, I came back, this time intent on getting to the bottom of the mystery that is my anchor locker. And I'm joined by a fan of the show. And we visit the red light district. Oh, yeah. My name is Rick. Join me as I refit sailing vessel Frog's Leap with an eye towards taking her to warmer places. I get to spend only a few days each month on the boat. That's why I call the channel Marina Queen. And we just came out of the Chevys in Berkeley. There's my wife checking things, but you can see. Somebody here broke out our window. It was a rental car. And Karen's calling the rental company now. I got my, my backpack. I left my backpack accidentally in here. There was nothing in it. Well, that was pretty crazy. We were having lunch, and after lunch, we were going to head to SFO, return the rental car, and get on our plane and, and head back to Spokane, which is exactly what we did. We always carry the full insurance that they sell. I know that's very expensive, but in times like these, you know, you really want to have full coverage so you can just hand the car over when you're done, regardless of what happens when you're interacting in the world. But the other lesson is don't leave anything visible in the car. And I left my backpack in the car. So I did one thing right with the insurance, did another thing not so right with the backpack. Back in Spokane from that outstanding trip with my wife, she got to see the boat. We didn't take it out, but that's not something she really cares that much about anyway. But we got to hang out on the boat and enjoy it, so that was a lot of fun. I'm actually heading back in a week for a pretty major last minute push to get everything that needs to get done. We'll see how well I do there. Well, it's warmer today. So I've been working outside and I brought the boat forward in her slip so that I could stand on the dock and work on the bow sprit. And what I'm trying to do is locate the bow roller so I can install it. You know, it occurs to me that maybe I'm not going to like this particular rock now. I may go with the Vulcan if this one doesn't work real good. So let me show you what I've got going on outside right now. can't really see it. Maybe you can. But they lined up the windlass to for this angle right here. So it's not straight on when you've got a, a straight on bow roller like that. I've got the anchor on the dock while I work on this. And there she is from the foredeck. Here you can really see how the windlass was installed at an angle. We're going to try to fix that. Stop drilling. I've 
gone deep enough. This is the chain locker. This is the chain right here. It's on the windlass. And you can see I've stretched it all the way out pretty much. I mean, we've just got a little cantonary in here. Let's go see how much chain we have. got the anchor house now. Here's a good time to tighten up that aft roller and help secure this Rockna 15 anchor. Rockna! Wow, so I think those hooks are going to be great. We've got hats, jackets, float coat, exposure suit, everything hanging in its place. Perfect. So I'll tell you something that I've picked up just from owning a boat and uh, having it at the marina. And, and that is, is that the people who are into sailing and who are present at the marina and often enough for you to know them, they all have interesting stories. I think th that each one of those lives that you meet at the marina is a life less ordinary. That's what I think. <laughs> Did somebody say something? <laughs> well, it's time to remove the headbanger. Hey everybody, so I want to introduce a fan of the show who is uh, came by the marina. We're going to do some projects, maybe go sailing and uh, hey, maybe be part of this uh, trip we're going to be doing. So uh, I would like to introduce you to Patrick. Hi, I'm Patrick. <laughs> so so uh, we're going to be filming some stuff and trying to keep the day as normal as possible. But we know you're watching, so you know, we're a little nervous. Ner nervous. Hopefully it doesn't sink the boat here drilling holes in it, I don't know. If I push too hard and I go through two layers, I'm in trouble. <laughs> I'm just gonna twist these before we set them. We got it wired up, and that's what we got. Oh yeah, red. Mm-hmm. Red. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, thanks again for watching another riveting episode of Marina Queen. Mm hmm. If you like the content, mm, that thumbs up button, so good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. If you want to see more of Marina Queen, oh, yeah, it's all about the subscribe button. I didn't make the rules. Mm hmm. I'll see you next week on the boat. New episode every Sunday. I'm not as think as you confused I am. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm.